Martin misses. I know he's on a cold streak, but he can't let that get in his head. Especially if you're a player that doesn't get a lot of shot attempts. But otherwise, the mindset is, I just got to get the next one to go. And you don't want to put that much pressure on yourself. What a two-way play. Just tremendous. Yeah, the steal was slick. The slam topped it off. And we say it time and time That's again, so I'll repeat it. I have to be careful with the ball, or this is what happens. Well orchestrated, and then the pass is right on the money. The Warriors have gone four of six from the floor in this third quarter. Third quarter of basketball here. A little under three and a half minutes gone by. Here's Bryant, and then Bryant what with the Bryant? dunk. I'll tell you, he is so tough to keep down once he gets near that rim. Yeah, he can get up even a few notches higher. Oh, got that bucket in no time at all. He's got six. And with his height and his touch, he could be deadly from mid-range. That's a staple of his offensive attack. And once again, he can do some damage from that area. Warrior substitution. Will Chamberlain. The Warriors have gotten five of seven attempts in the third quarter. Here's Kidd. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. And just totally relentless. Only increasing the intensity level. And he's the guy that you want to go to right now trying to put this one away. Time called here. The Spurs decide to talk it over. And let's send it over to Allie LaForce. Thanks, guys. The NBA last season celebrated its 75th anniversary and announced the 75 greatest players in NBA history gathering the living greats during the All-Star break. A lot of history, but Commissioner Silver said, we're a pretty young league when you think about it. Brian, I guess it's all relative. Yeah, indeed. Thanks for that, Alec. Johnson's checked in. San Antonio has gone over two from outside here in the third. To the inside. Here's Eaton. Tries again. It's deflected. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Warriors. And that shot was going nowhere thanks to that aggressive swat. <laughs> what a play. I mean, that'll have the offense thinking twice about taking shots in his presence. The Warriors have gotten six of eight shots to go and looking good since the break. Outside Johnson. A minute 37 left in the third. Oh, and a fast break for the Spurs. And Durant with the block. Instinct, timing, length. KD, great deep. Oh, and Johnson slams it in. They've been very well-rounded and extremely focused. Coaching staff probably most proud of the effort of this team on both ends of the floor here tonight. Out of bounds. It'll be Warriors ball. Golden State ball. One minute left in the third quarter. Leonard finds some space. Then there's another one for the Warriors. Well, part of the game plan was to neutralize the crowd. And guess what? Mission accomplished. Always a good sign of maturity and steps forward when you can take this kind of effort, focus, and concentration on the road to get a win. No way he's going to pass that shot. He is way too far back and relaxed in getting out on it. For three, Hardaway with the tip. It's good on the putback. Griffin's got his third bucket of the night. Well, a missed box out and an easy tip in, but it's because of the activity as the ball is going up, finding Holy yourself Brian. in the right spot, just using some effort. you got to try to scramble the Jets right here and get that guy off the sweet spot. It's one of the best three-point shooters in the league. Incredible. It sometimes falls to the point guard to be the offensive catalyst. Seems like he always knows when his squad needs a lift. 
Did you see how much air he had under him? Wow. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. Well, I know they don't have mobile devices out there for texting, so they might as well talk to one another. Well, through three quarters of play, down double digits. It may be difficult to overcome. Warriors ahead. They lead by 14. And we're just moments away from the start of quarter number four. Stay with us. And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works, or if it's more of the same for the first three quarters. Well, San Antonio's shooting only 42% on the court for Golden State to start the fourth. They've got Kevin Durant. Johnson is out there with Kobe Bryant. Then there's Kawhi Leonard. Well, that's not a shot he's ever going to pass up, and he shouldn't. Despite the miss, no defender anywhere near him. He's got to shoot that one. Got to appreciate the aggressive defense he brings. Well, it's about the defensive end, and that's what guys feed off. He gives the effort down there at all times. Inside. And he was camped in the lane there. He gets a three-second call. Time called here. The Spurs decide to talk it over. They're giving up a lot of points in the paint. That's something they have to address here. Yeah, coach knows that. They know that. In the timeout, they're going to hear about it, make the adjustment. Who wants one? Spurs fans, let's get on our feet and make some noise for the Spurs Pack Squad. making a change here. Wade's checked in. And the Warriors making a switch here. A moment to hear from Ali LaForce. Over the last break, I got a chance to hear what Greg Popovich was telling his team. He told them, quote, if we'd worked harder on the glass, we'd probably be up right now. Show some heart. Show some pride. It was a very direct message. Back to you guys. Ali, thank you. Out to Rose. Let's go with a three. Counted from distance. And the Warriors lead by 17. Not sure when Kawhi saw him, but the fact is he did, and he delivered. It's a great pass. Got a hand on it. And as it goes out of bounds, San Antonio will keep possession. Thompson, he's checked in for Rose. Warrior substitution. Play the steal. Thompson. Leonard outside. Left side, Johnson. Three-pointer. Rebounded by the Spurs. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. Pass to Eden. Kicks it out to Hardaway. And there's a three-second violation. Three violation. Talk about a way to Warrior deflate the team. Ball. Yeah, he knows he shouldn't have made it, and that's just really overall a frustrating sequence that hopefully doesn't stick with him. Here's Thompson. And it's in after Play a nice Thompson. bounce off the right iron. Yeah, you got to stay in front of Clay if you're going under the screen and he recognizes that, you're going to get scored on. And despite the height disadvantage, oh my, he just attacks that interior. Yeah, no stopping him on that play. Sometimes even the taller defenders are helpless to stop him. Now you have to extend that defense. I mean, you really have to stay connected to him at all times. I'm not sure what the defense collectively was thinking there. you got to know where he is at all times. Leonard outside. Davis, the pass to Thompson. A touch under two and a half minutes have passed now here in the fourth. San Antonio's going 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. George for three. Doesn't go that time. And Golden State will come the other way. Thompson outside. Outside Johnson. Back to Thompson. It's hauled in by Eaton. A challenging stretch here for San Antonio. Is Griffin. And Davis with the block. And he gets it back. Out of bounds. It'll be Warriors ball.
The Warriors have gotten three of seven attempts in this fourth quarter to fall. Johnson passes to Davis. And again, no good by Golden State. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Dwayne Wade has taken thousands of shots where he's been challenged, and he's made them just like that. Golden State has got two of five threes to go here in the fourth, and they go to the intentional foul. And the Warriors making a change here. First team foul. We played just over three and a half minutes now in the fourth quarter. Bryant outside. Outside Durant. Down low. Jacks up a three. And Bryant good for three. Bryant's got ten points in just the second half. This is what he does. Find space on the perimeter and then sink the three. Jordan with the bucket. Strong performance from him. But he may need to do even more if they're going to win this game. Here's Kidd. Finds the open look and it's on target. And the Warriors lead by 21. Imagine how much bigger this lead might be if he were a little more selfish. And a bit of a battle for the ball. And the officials signal a jump ball here. And here are the Warriors now. The Warriors have got five out of ten shots to drop here in the final quarter. Goes up on the wing. The kick to Durant. The three is up, and the Warriors with Kevin another Durant. three. You just can't let Kevin Durant have a half a second of time. If he gets that ball, it's gone, and there's points on the board. And there's a three-second call. This one on the defense. And a closer look here at the hustle stats for the Warriors. Well, you have to like what you've seen from them defensively. They've done well contesting shots and have managed to come away with some blocks, too. Well, if we add another thing to it, it's about the urgency they've played with. I mean, you look at the eyes of these guys. They're focused, wanting to get up tempo, and that's helped them score on the fast break. To the inside, Irving. And it's going to be a goaltending call here, so they will count the bucket. It's safe to say they have dominated this game. The game wasn't even as close as the score says in a great win for the Warriors. Their shot blocking was a huge advantage in this game. Yeah, I love the excellent defense in the paint. It led to a lot of key stops. And KD keeping his head up that time, becoming a playmaker. Here's Jordan. Here's Abdul-Jabbar. It's rebounded by Golden State. George over to help. On the wing, Durant. Pass to Kidd. Bryant against George. Four on the clock. Bryant, no good. It's a four-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Jordan with it. Takes the three. It's good. Set up beautifully by George. Oh, nice feed. On time and on target. Pass to Durant for three. He buries it from three. And they came in here with some attitude, and it brought out their best play. Yeah, looks like a veteran team tonight. Getting out on the road, playing with assertiveness, confidence, fully in control for this win. And so it's the Warriors taking care of business in this one. To walk into enemy territory and deliver a performance like that, that says a lot about this one. They really came in looking tough. and didn't let anything shake them. This is what a dominant team looks like. And that about wraps it up. For Ali LaForce, Grant Hill, and Brent Perry, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching tonight's game.